P Dubs, the retro sports jock wizard. Ever since I could remember, I've been playing sports video games with my older brother Gabe. Games like Super Action Baseball and Super Action Football for the ColecoVision. I mean, I was so young the first time I played Tecmo Bowl for the NES, I literally learned the rules of American football playing that game. I'll admit, games have come a long way since the first time I picked up a controller. But there's something about the old 8-bit and 16-bit games that is so nostalgic to me. It brings back memories of nights we stayed up way past our bedtime mastering these games. Come join us as we play and discuss these timeless gems. I am P-Dubs, the Retro Sports Jock Wizard, and tonight I'm going to be discussing college basketball games. Uh, in particular, uh, Sega Genesis uh, put out one of my favorite college basketball games of all time. My favorite college basketball game. Uh, this game was put out by Electronic Arts. Um, in conjunction with uh, Hitman Productions uh, out of Canada in 1995, Coach K College Basketball. My favorite college basketball game of all time. There's only 32 teams to choose from. Uh, you can only do a 32 uh, team tournament at the end of the year. Doesn't matter. This is the purest, greatest, 16-bit college basketball game, if not one of the greatest college basketball games ever created. Um, so some of the things you can do on this, um, it's got uh, real collegiate strategy, including uh, zone defenses, animated play diagrams, over 50 offensive plays, uh, 14 different defensive sets. Uh, on the fly play calling you can you can hit one of the uh, top three buttons to, to call it call your either offensive or defensive plays um, There's a coach K report. Uh, he scouts each team uh, Detailed halftime and game summary um, There's new animations obviously they're old now um, you can shatter the backboard uh, with monster dunks you can pass on the run, turbo features on the fast break, dunks, alley-oops. One of the first games that had alley-oops. Um, you can block dunks. Um, you can do mid-air passes. You can you can jump and pass. Uh, it was one of the, the first games to, you know, you were able to do that as well. Um, the college crowd sounds are incredible. Um, you can do um, a full season, of course. Like, I won't even play a sports game unless it will keep my stats and I can do a full season. Um, it's not even relevant. If you can't do a regular season, throw it out. Um, there's a yeah, 32 game season. Uh, you can do a 4, 8, 16, or a 32 team tournament at the end of your season. Um, this was also four player compatible. Um, you know, you could have four people on the same team, two on two, three on one, however you wanted to swing it. Um, it's also got a weekly top 25 poll um, that it shares uh, after every week. Um, legendary Coach Krzyzewski on the cover. Can't go wrong with this game. It's super cheap. Just make sure you got a new save battery in there. Uh, none of these games are even worth playing if, if you can't save your stats. I'm one of those stat guys. Um, it also has some old-time teams on here. Um, it's got UCLA from 67, uh, 72 UCLA, 74 North Carolina State, 76 Indiana team, uh, 79 Michigan State. Of course, Magic Johnson's on that team. Uh, 86 Louisville. 1990 UNLV uh, in the 1992 Duke team, of course, with, with Christian Leitner and Grant Hill on that team. Um, it, it doesn't have the players' names. Uh, it does have the numbers. So 
if, if you're a sports guy like me, you know exactly who these guys are. So I'm going to fire up a season on here and uh, show you some of the gameplay. EA Sports. It's in the game.
Thank you.